So for this first question, we have 6 and a little 3, which we read as 6 cubed. Now this 3 means multiply the number by itself and then multiply it by itself again. So 6 cubed means 6 times 6 times 6. So 6 times 6 is 36, but then we need to take that 36 and multiply it by 6 again. Now 6 times 6 is 36, so 3, 6. And 3 times 6 is 18, plus 3 is 21. So 6 cubed is 216. Now 7 cubed, so that's 7 times 7 times 7. 7 times 7 is 49, and then we take that 49 and multiply it by 7 again. 9 times 7 is 63, so 6, 3, and 4 times 7 is 28, plus 6 is 34, so 7 cubed is 343. Now for 8 cubed, we can work out 8 times 8, which is 64, and then multiply 64 by another 8, because it's 8 cubed, not 8 squared. So, 4 times 8 is 32, so 3, 2. 6 times 8 is 48, plus 3 is 51. So, 8 cubed is 512. And now 9 cubed, we start with 9 times 9, which is 81, but we take that 81 and multiply it by 9 again. So 1 times 9 is 9, 8 times 9 is 72, so 9 cubed is 729.